Here's your Storm Track 7 forecast. I'm Storm Track 7 meteorologist Joy Bettenhausen. Well, some of us are dealing with some cloud cover versus our neighbors to the south. They're not seeing any. Let's take a look at that right now. Storm Track 7 Live Weather Network. This is in Waterloo. We've got that extensive cloud cover. Sun's trying to shine through the clouds, but take a quick trip down south. Now we're in Coralville, and we've got that blue sky. Quite a bit of interesting there, and that's because we've got this low pressure system that's sitting way up north in Wisconsin. That's starting to feed some cloud cover down into our northern counties. That, but that's not making it all the way to our southern counties. We're likely not going to see that cloud cover last throughout the entire day. Threat tracker showing we've got some clouds, and of course, it's going to be windy once again. Tomorrow morning, we could see a couple light showers in our northern counties. We keep the wind. Temperatures will be cooler. And then by Wednesday, even more cloud cover filters in. And of course, we can't shake the wind. We know that we've been dealing with some pretty windy days over the past couple. Today, we could see gusts of up to 35 miles per hour throughout the day. That also will die down later on tonight and then pick right back up tomorrow morning. We're likely to see even more 35 mile per hour wind gusts. Future track showing this cloud cover is going to stay in our northern counties and it's likely to break up by early evening. So that's good. We see a little bit more sunshine before that sun does set. Cloud cover starts to push in overnight tonight where we could see maybe a couple of very light showers. And that shower chance will be possible throughout much of the day on Tuesday. Not really expecting much from it, just maybe a couple sprinkles. Those anywhere from Old Wine down south to Washington, you're not going to have to deal with that rain chance there. Today's highs, upper 50s, low 60s, mostly sunny to partly cloudy skies. Overnight tonight, we're dropping down to the 30s. So that means patchy frost will be possible once again tonight. Now we'll be under a partly cloudy sky. City by city forecast, Waterloo, Dubuque, Cedar Rapids, and Iowa City. More partly cloudy skies tomorrow, but that cloud cover starts to fill in by Wednesday. Highs tomorrow look to be only in the upper 40s, the low 50s in some locations. Patchy frost will be possible once again Tuesday night into Wednesday. We stick under the clouds throughout much of the work week. Slight chance of rain for Saturday, and it looks to be another chance of rain for the start of next work week.